with Season 2 of The Walking Dead from Telltale Games. Um, this game has... this is obviously Xbox One. This has had an issue with streaming for quite a while. Um, and it looks like it's finally working. So, we're going to start off with episode Uno. Here we go. Now, I had already previously set up the settings for this, I believe. We're going to double check anyway. Set this up in October. So it should still be... Lower the volume a little bit. Still should be the correct settings. By correct settings, I mean subtitles on, because there's really nothing else to... Okay. Only nothing else to, to switch, really. Now, just make sure I have this set up properly. Okay. <coughs> Let's go. Let's start it. Let's start it up. Episode 1, All That Remains. Um, yeah, I want to. Uh, season 2 of The Walking Dead builds off Season 1's choices and consequences. The game will automatically search. Okay. Yes, please, automatically search. <laughs> Otherwise, it's a waste playing this game. Yes, let's go. I'm definitely going to choose a save slot. Now. Definitely not choosing this one. Going for this one. Complete. You have been completed. Previously on The Walking Dead. What's your name? I'm Clementine. You've been all by yourself through this? <laughs> I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. Murderer. It's how the world works now! We are those bad people dead? I hope you know what you're doing with her. I got it! Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are. Clementine, I, I think it'd be safer for you to stay here with Omi. Clementine? Clementine! She wouldn't be exposed to what she has been with you. Die! We, I saw my parents. Oh boy. You can leave me. It's okay. Y you can come with me. No, honey, I can't. It's okay. That's right, I didn't shoot him. I forgot about that. What do you think? Oh, Midge, you can't be serious. I am. We are not doing that. Why not? Because. 
Come on, Krista. What's wrong with Omid? We're not calling our baby Omid. One of you is enough. Clementine, a little help here? Omid yeah. Second. No. Omid Jr. We're continuing no. on our quest of yeah, saying admit nothing. It has a ring to it. Yeah, the ring of an egotistical maniac. Hey, you're gonna have to talk to this person for years. You get a vote. No, you're season not two is really where it's gonna get I crazy. Everything seriously. Saying nothing. Especially the Lomid's future. Keep talking, and you'll be sleeping in the rain tonight. Remember that time in Barstow? Vegas weekend. Oh snap. Why don't you uh, uh, get cleaned up in the girls' room, Clem? I hope the sink works in there. I wouldn't count on it. Just be careful and make sure to keep track of your things. We'll be right next door. Okay. <clears throat> How come only Clem's going Hello? in the girls' room? Alright. How oh, gross. Looks like my bathroom. Let's go with this one next. Only one left. Ugh, what's that? Good. No one's here. Guess it's safe to get cleaned up. I guess so. Sure will. Please, please work. Please have work. Water. Something tells me it won't. Figures. Ah shucks. Shit. No water spilled on the ground, though. That's good. I believe it went in the second one, but we're gonna try all of them. And you can run in this one by holding down the uh, right trigger. Although, I wouldn't call this running, but it definitely is speedier. Because in season one, if you press the right trigger, it just. It acted as if you were pressing an action. Oh, shit, it went on the third one. Ew. He was right. Uh-oh. Keep it quiet. Shh, 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 shh. I see you. Oh shit. Get out of there. You're not fooling me. Silence is definitely a valid response. Come on out now. What are you doing? Get out here.
You got anything on you? Come on, let's see. I ain't got shit, bitch. You holding everything. I ain't gonna ask again. Oh shit. Don't shoot me, alright? I'm serious. What else you got? That's it. Don't lie to me. I'll pop you. Give me what you got. I'm not screwing around. Come on. Oh, bitch. Don't. Give me that hat. No! Where'd you get it? I asked you a question. Ooh, give hat. No, thank you. Letting this play out. No! Junk, junk, junk. Look at all this junk. Shit, shit, and more shit. Why you ain't got nothing good? Not like the last people I got. They had all kinds of good shit. That was a good catch. You ain't got nothing good. You're just a little fish. You gonna cry, little fish? This your daddy? What a bozo. Oh shit. Over for you. Ah. Uh, Just like everyone else, I'm sure. I really like Don't Mean. Can you hear me? Oh, me. Sixteen months. What's going to happen? Krista, talk to me. This will never work. Look at this. It's pathetic. The wood's too wet to burn. It's more smoke than flame. At this rate, we'll be eating this for breakfast. Just our luck. You should be doing this, not me. Tending a fire so you can cook and stay warm. It's something you have to be able to do, Clementine. Otherwise... Uh, nothing. I say nothing. Omid said that- I know what Omid said. I didn't pick that. <clears throat> I'm freezing. You think this is bad? Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me about coal. If we make it. We still have a couple hard months ahead of us. This rain will turn to sleet. Then ice. Then snow. It won't be easy. 
Nothing's ever easy. Wellington's a long way from here. We just need to keep moving north. I do miss Lee. I'm gonna go look for more wood. You just keep the fire lit. It's a lovely looking rabbit. pick some stuff to burn, but I'm not burning that picture of Lee. You can! I'm not going to do it. So as I was saying before, uh, when I first started this, we're doing the, obviously as you can see from the title, the silent choices, but differing a little bit from season one, season two if you haven't played it yet, um, which I recommend you do even if you watch this. Um, the choices actually make a difference in a lot of, in, well, I wouldn't say a lot, but in some situations. I mean, you can end up completely, completely different to what I end up if you play the game certain ways and you pick certain decisions at the end of the season. Uh, same thing with, with choices in, in episodes. The choices actually matter. So now, picking the silent choices this time around... You can kind of affect the story, and I'm, I'm very curious to see how the story plays out because of that. Because, as you know, with season one, it's pretty self-contained. I mean, you can choose what to say, and people will remember what you're going to say and, you know, act that way, but the story doesn't get changed at all. It's you. It's A to B. Actually, it's A to, a to Z, but the 24 letters in between are always the same. At least this way, it changes a little bit. And definitely changes drastically at the end. That's for sure. Ah, oh, poor Lee. In my silent playthrough for season one, I did not shoot Lee. But I did in my original playthrough on 360. Oh, there's Kenny, Katya, and Duck. I believe I burnt that one in my original playthrough. I don't remember there being a lighter. Interesting. Oh, well, actually, you know what? That's probably how she lights the fire. That makes sense. I think there are... I think there are... There's wood somewhere, and I don't believe she can actually light it because it's too wet. Maybe I was wrong. So that's why you have to burn something that, of yours. Sworn there was f wood. I'm gonna look at the campfire first. Didn't ask me to what I wanted to burn. Better, That's later. But still not enough. Okay, there we the go. The flames are too low. Well, this piece of paper ain't gonna be really <laughs> that great. License plate. This All right. Burn. So that's how we know we're in North Carolina, or assumed. I mean, honestly, in a story like this, there's no point in showing North Carolina if you're not in North Carolina. So. There's the log. This might burn. There was I could have sworn there were other there were other pieces of wood out here that said it would not burn. What was it the name of the torn jacket? This'll never burn. It's too wet. Ah, that's what was too wet. That's what it was. 
something else of import. We ain't in Georgia anymore. Nothing. Okay. Add fuel to the fire. Uh, yeah, definitely not burning the photo or the drawing. My first playthrough, I don't even think I found the log. Like a moron, so that's why I burned the drawing. That can't be good. Bullshit. She's lying. Cut the shit, lady. It's it's just me. Come on, Ooh, I'm guys. Gonna let it go it's here. Not saying. You expect us to believe you're out here all alone? Who the fuck do you think you're fooling? Oh Why shit! Ah! Oh, he stabbed her. Hey!
Hello? Krista, are you there? Yeah, I don't think Krista's here. Now, <clears throat> there is a... Let's see. There is a part in this game... Well, let me just say this in this, in this episode... That if you had watched my previous series of Season 1, I explained quite often, I'm sure, um, that I had bawled my eyes out when the holy death was happening. Like, hardcore, like I had just lost my best friend type of crying. Uh, there is something that rivaled it in this episode. <laughs> Which is, <laughs> it's sad, not only in the game, but I mean it's sad that I did it, but at the same time, I don't even care. I mean, that's just the kind of person I am. I'm a little, I'm a little baby when it comes to things. I put myself in the shoes of everything that I'm playing or watching, and I just, I just let it go. Because I don't really cry that much in real life. But if, uh, if I'm investing myself in something like this, I put myself in their shoes, and that's how it gets it going. So I'll, I'll let you know where it is, where it happens. I'm sure you can figure it out by watching it once it happens. But yeah, it rivaled season one's ending. Like, hardcore. I had to pause the game for a while. <laughs> Alright, let's keep going. Let's do my little run here. Interesting. What? My quick walk. Ooh, it's a little chilly. Wish I had my coat. I'm going to do nothing here, but obviously you want to pet the dog, but I'm going to do nothing to see what happens. Basically the same thing. Okay. What's he doing? Hey, what'd you find, boy? Where are you going? Wait up! Looks pretty run over, but you never know.
Let's look around for some food. What could like be in this dirty van? Oh, there's his owners. Looks like they were a happy family once. I hope they left some food behind somewhere. It's odd that she doesn't technically mention that the dog is clearly in that picture, and that's his owner. Just a little odd. Hmm. Nothing edible. Okay. Come on. Man, the movement on the sticks seems a little off. Hey, wanna play? Wanna play catch? I think we can do this three times. Go get it, boy. Okay, bring it back. Good boy. Good boy. Try it again. Want to go again? You know he does. <laughs> You miss this. I sure do. I bet he does. Try it again. Let's go one more time. Go get it, boy. <laughs> Darn. It was good while it lasted, though, right? Ah. Uh. Yeah, you're right. Shouldn't waste the energy anyway. <laughs> It's true. Mm, empty. Better keep looking, boy. It's like a beer can. Why would you want it want it anyway? It's not much of a tent anymore. I bet scavengers tore it apart. It looks kinda bloody, I don't think it was scavengers. No. Okay. Hey, boy. What's the matter? Here comes a sad scene for the dog. Shh. We have to be quiet. No. <clears throat> she. Something happens here with this gentleman. Uh. Well, indirectly with this gentleman. But let me uh. I don't want to go over there just yet. Talk about it for a second. No it's very odd either. on how this plays out. I don't understand how on earth you would ever decide to do what she's about to do. It makes no sense to me. But, you know, then again, video games and all Think that. Anyone's been sleeping in here? I can't tell. Why? Why be realistic in any way? All right, let's let's get to it. I have to get over there. It's gonna be cooler first, actually. Please let there be something good in there. Ugh, Ooh. God, no food on the grill. Nothing in the cooler. Ugh, I hate scavengers. They take everything. You're a scavenger. Who are you? You're all scavengers at this point. It's okay. He's dead. No, he's not. Well, Look, you can see the bite. Looks like he tried to cut it out. But that never works. Ever. Oh, it does. Just not for your buddy. It's okay. We're smart. He's not. We're smarter than all of them. Alright, so... 
That's clearly his owner, as evidenced by the picture, if you had picked it up, which we did. Hey, it's okay, boy. Shh. He can't hurt us. Think he had himself tied up? Or did someone force him to do this? I think it's pretty clear what happened. Oh, wait a minute. Do I have to grab something first? There it is. That's why. Come on. Let's take a while to do this. Stand back, okay? It's very pointy at the edges. At the end here. You'd think you'd want to just stab them. But again, video games. Doesn't look cool if you stab them. It looks cool if you keep hitting them. Come on, you're dead. Let's go. All right, now you're good. Both times the charm. See, we just have to stay out of their reach. I feel like I don't know if the dog really understands what happened. I think they I might. I like to think that if they were alive, they probably want to help you. Nothing. I don't remember ever looking in that. I don't know if they're letting you know the dog understands what's going on or not from that look. Poor guy. I'd like to think that the dog knows. Alright, now see. <sighs> Still pretty sharp. And she wipes the blood off. Useful. We won't go another night without food. Okay. Now we're gonna we're gonna spoil alert here, as we're gonna see in just a few seconds. We're gonna find some food. I don't remember where it is. We're gonna find, find anything it. yet. Let's pet the dog, since we didn't get to pet him earlier. Maybe it's in here. It's gotta be. I don't know where else it could be. <sighs> well, here we go. Get in there. <gasps> oh my god. Thank you. Alright. Look, a can! <gasps> Let's see what's inside. No, I think we all know what's about to happen here. Why the fuck would you use that knife? You just pulled out of a walker. I don't care if you wiped Please it off. Please don't be bad. This makes no sense to me. Let's go. Let's go with left first. <clears throat> I'm gonna go here. Then we'll go here. <sighs> Thank God. What is it? it? Looks like beans. Now, obviously, you're gonna feed the dog. I'm not gonna press anything, but I'm pretty sure that's where it's gonna go. <laughs> Oh, interesting. I fed the dog. Feel bad? Now this happens anyway. See, this is what happens even if you feed the dog. Uh, this happens even if you feed him. He gets greedy. Try to pull it away.
Now, we heard what happened. Oh, this is tough for me. This is the part I was talking about earlier. Oh! Now, I obviously I killed the dog. My first run. Oh, that hurts me. I'm going to leave him now just because I want to see what happens. <sighs> she just cuts his neck. Oh, man. I'm sorry. All right, this is really painful to watch. Ugh. Anyway, what I was going to say was, if you had gone to the left or the right as it showed on the screen, you could grab, like, a branch or something to hit the dog with. It just plays out the same way. Poor dog. <sighs> don't pass out. You don't know what's going to happen. I think, I think we're safe. Yeah, yeah, we're good. Hey, you all right? I'm dead. Let's keep silent. Okay, I'll take that as a no. What are you doing out here? Where are the, uh, the people you're with? There's no chance you made it this long on your own. I don't want them thinking we're doing anything but trying to help you. Hmm. I'm not sure how the group's gonna feel about another mouth to feed. Uh, I don't think they'll like it. I hate to break this to you, kid, but, uh, I'm an expert at talking to girls who don't want to talk to me. Well, you've got plenty of practice. Pete, come on, man, I don't need your help. Well, I'm Luke, and this is Pete. Hey there. Hi, I'm Clementine. 
And it's nice to meet you, Clementine. But for now, we're gonna take you back to our group. Okay, we got a doctor with us, and you look like you could use some- Oh, shit! <laughs> what? What is it? She's- She's been bit, man. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. What are we gonna do here? No, it was a dog. I didn't see any dog, Clementine. What, you think that happened two seconds ago? I just saw you with those lurkers back there. I can't remember the last time I saw a dog. So what do we do now? Hmm. All right. Let's see. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, watch yourself. Hey, don't look at me like that. You're the one that's bit here, okay? Is it, uh, is it like she says? Uh, well, it could be a dog. Hard to say. So where'd this dog go? The one that did this. Now, what, what does that matter, Pete? Seriously. I want to know how believable her story is. Very believable, I swear. If you don't know, just say you don't know, okay? Otherwise, it seems like you're hiding something from us. Clementine? Yes? You telling us the truth? You look me in the eyes when you answer. Sorry, buddy, we're saying nothing. All right, Clementine. That's good enough for me. What? Look, she didn't even say anything. She doesn't <laughs> like someone calling her a liar. <laughs> I've got a good bullshit detector, Luke. That's why you can never beat me at poker. <laughs> you don't always beat me at it. <laughs> Alright, how can you be sure? Well, I'm sure I ain't willing to leave a little girl in the woods to die when we got a doctor with us that can make a call. We can have Carlos take a look at it first. Nick ain't gonna like this. Not with what happened. You don't have to remind me of that, boy. Right. Sorry, sir. Sorry, sir. Clementine, are you feeling all right? I'm fine. I'm just tired. Well, you better be fine. Because I ain't carrying you anymore with that bite on your arm. Don't worry about... Ah, oh, shit. Uh-oh. She said she was bitten by a dog. What? And you just believed her? You should have put her out of her misery right there. Dog bite my ass. Damn it. Do I have to be the man around? Oh, oh, shit. Keep your finger off the trigger, boy. Whoa! Whoa! What the you fuck? You idiot! Every lurker for five miles probably hurt You're the that. one telling me to fucking shoot her. Everybody just calm down for a second. Clementine, you okay? We got a doctor right here. Okay, he'll have a look. You know what the hell is wrong with you people? Okay, she's just scared. We're all scared, Luke. Don't act like we're the ones being irrational because we don't buy this bullshit story. No way she survived out here on her own. Why are we even arguing about this? Let You're me take bullshit. a look. I hate you. She sucks. I don't even remember her name. That's how much she okay. sucks. Go ahead, he's a doctor. Must have hurt. Come on, man, that doesn't look bigger than a Whatever mouth was, for a human. It got you good. This isn't how we do things, man. When you're bit, you get put down. End of story. I'm not going through this again. No one's suggesting that. We could take her arm off. <gasps> I know that worked for a cousin down in Ainsworth. We could try that. It won't do any good. You'll just be making it worse for the girl. It's crazy. 
No one's going to volunteer to do that. I would, if it means saving her life. Then what? How would we know it worked? Just let Carlos have a look first. Let them talk it out. Sweet. Who's she? Sarah. What I say, stay inside. Carlos, we've been through this before. We all agree. We don't wait for shit like this. End of story. So, what do you think? Was it a lurker? A bite like that could be anything. Only one way to find out. How? We wait. What? By tomorrow morning, if the fever set in, we'll know if she's gonna turn. In the meantime, we can lock her in the shed. What about my arm? It needs to get cleaned and, and stitched and bandaged. Yeah, man, jeez. The girl is in bad shape, Carlos. We have all that stuff inside the cabin. We could probably get by Alvin, with it. Alvin, please. But, yeah. We Damn, can't. bitch. I'm Every time with you. i on a lurker bite. If it turns out you're telling the truth, I'll clean it and stitch it up for you in the morning. But... I'm sorry. It's the best we're gonna get. Finger off the trigger, son. I ain't your son. Don't be like that, man. It's all right. Boy's got his mom's temper. Don't be a dick, man. Come on. Dick, man. This is just a waste of time. You'll see. And when she turns, I ain't gonna be the one cleaning up the shit. This fucking bitch, man. Uh, as much as I want to talk to you, I ain't gonna do it. Look, Let's give him a hold dirty out the stare. Best you can, Clementine, and we'll see what's what in the morning. Yeah, where the fuck are you gonna leave me? If I even make it in that cesspool, you sons of bitches. Because it's safer this way, and I'd rather be sure. Yeah, <sighs> I can't believe this. I don't fucking believe it. You're gonna be fine. You're gonna be fine. <sighs> okay. Let's take a look at this barrel. this tackle box not much left in here I guess if I have to I can use this for stitches shizzle now that hole right there that don't look very good that'll probably come into play later Please, that's as high as you can jump. Are you kidding me?
to. <clears throat> Didn't I grab the hammer? No? Well, I thought I did. Way to break it. They have a doctor. He's gotta have stuff for stitches. All right, now in my original playthrough on 360, I went straight for the place you have to go. In my girlfriend's playthrough, she, uh, I kind of made her. So this is where we ended up with her. We're gonna do it here. Oops, nope, not what I wanted to do. It makes me feel like a fucking idiot when we're not on the same page. We oh, are on okay. the same page. Not out there, we weren't. Not about the girl. I saw you get soft. I hit tap on the window. What do you want me to do, Beck? Put a bullet I wanted to just. Look, I want you to think about our family matter. first. It's all I think about. So don't give me the shit. I need the mayor. Yo, what up, Doe? You can't see me? Cool. It's that little girl. What the hell are you doing? Damn, bitch, you gonna get me killed. I can't be seen talking to you. Are you out of your mind? Even if you ain't bitten by some lurker, which you probably are, you can't be here. You gotta get out of here, you understand? Get back into that shed and Carlos. I'm starting to think now if I play it out the way I'm planning on Damn this playthrough, I'm not gonna it's not gonna play it the same Damn way. It, girl, you're gonna get me in trouble. I'm serious, you need to get out of here. I saw when everyone was arguing. You wanted to help. You didn't see anything. Look, you gotta get out of here before my wife finds you. I'm serious, you gotta go. I got enough problems already. We got a baby on the way, Rebecca's all emotional. Got a mess of hormones causing all sorts of trouble. I don't need any more, get it? Now go. I get it. Good, glad you get it. Yep. Yep. So, I didn't get what I was wanting. Um, <clears throat> if you talk to him and you play it out the normal way, you know, not being silent the whole time, he will risk his life, apparently, to get me... Yeah, you can't go in here. I just want to see what happened. Um, he will risk his quote-unquote life with his wife um, and get you a juice box. But that's all he can get you. But still, it's appreciated. And you can actually... Oh, I forgot. And it's, um, it's appreciated. You can actually use it. Use the juice box a little bit later. It's ancillary. It doesn't make a difference. It's, you know... Just cosmetic, but it's kind of cool. I liked it. Get in there. House meeting in five minutes. They've got running water. It won't take long. There's a few things we need to discuss. Fine. Mm. 
Nope. No good. Let's try the hammer. Nope. Oh, shit. At least it worked. Well, Luke has more to say, I guess. Where's Sarah? She's got her book. She doesn't need to be a part of this. Listen in on this meeting. She could be. We don't know. She's connected to somebody. There's no way she's out here by herself. Whoever she's with, they'll probably come looking for her. Great. They show up, and we've got her locked in the shed. You think you don't want to get caught. Although I, I only listened twice. Let's see how long we can listen. You really think Carver would come after us? You think he would? Not exactly the type of nothing, nothing we can do about it. Let him come. I really don't give a damn. Alvin. What? I don't. Nice. So I guess three times. Oh, let's try a fourth time. Now it made me brush away both those times. The second time. Third time. You'd have done the same. It wasn't the brightest idea. Oh, firing your rifle was, huh? Next time we'll just put up a neon sign. Where are you going, huh? I want to get my sweater. We'll be going in a minute. I don't know what they're saying. I can't hear it. I have a feeling I'm going to get caught. About to get eaten alive. And you're telling us it was a dog? Yeah. Yeah, I know it sounds crazy, but look, for whatever reason, I think she's telling the truth. Look, there's no point in arguing about it now. She's in the shed. I really want to hear this whole conversation. <laughs> that true? The girl could really die. If the infection spreads, anything's possible. I feel like I'm tempting fate every time. We have some. Not enough to spare. We're not wasting anything on her. What if one of us needs it? Look, I'm just saying we could help. We need to think about things. I can't let her die. Not if there's something we can do about it. Whoa! See, it stopped on its own. You know, I'm not gonna attempt it anymore. Go do what you gotta do. If I even have time now. Come on. Bedroom door, definitely. That's where I need to go. It's clean. Thank you. True. Ah, poop. We have to have medical supplies around here somewhere. If 
thought I hid in this bathroom. Oh, yeah, there it is. I think this is where I hid last time. I can't remember where Megan hid. It ain't gonna be his. So now if you remember what I was saying earlier at the beginning where your choices actually make a difference towards the end of the game. In a way, um, my game I ended up in a specific spot and my girlfriend ended up different spot as well from where I was um, with different people I kind of want to end up where I was originally but I want to change it up I feel like the way I need to play this game I want to play the same way but I don't know if being silent the whole time is going to allow that to happen so that's where it's going to get tricky Oh, what's up, four eyes? Keep your mouth shut. You're not supposed to be in here. Yeah, I don't want. I don't like you, girl. It's the only place with enough light to read my book. Please don't tell me. It does hurt. You should have seen the other guy. I'll help you. Good. Thank you. I'm Sarah. We're friends. Right? We can be best friends. I haven't met another girl my age since way before. I don't like you, Sarah. I'm glad we barely talked. I'm looking. Let's go. Global domination. Actually, let's go over here first. No, no, I tried to move you. Uh, this could come in handy. Klepto.
You gotta. Maybe you gotta turn it. No, not just pulling it. Not exactly bandages, but they should help stop the bleeding. All right. Anything else we got going on in here? Other than another achievement, nothing. How am I going to get out of here without anyone seeing me? It's so loud. Still having the meeting. We apologize for being assholes, and then we help fix She can't stay with us. We barely have enough supplies for ourselves. We've got more fish in the trap. It's not the problem. It's who she might have. We gotta keep an eye on. If she doesn't turn. Whoa. She probably will. I gotta take a leap. Hold on, I'm almost done. Alright, you know what? We'll just go. We'll just get out of here then. I'm glad they don't make you climb all the way back out to go here on your own. Just tedious. definitely does. Alright, so if you had gotten the juice box from um, Arvin, I believe that's his name, this is where you could you could drink it right here. Um, let's go with this one first. Oh boy. Yeah, I definitely want to back out. Can we just pretend this didn't happen? I can feel that hurting because I had to do something similar a while okay. back. Okay, I'm good. Oh. I'm fine. I know the pain. Now the fun part. Yeah. <laughs> uh, let's see. Let's see what the bandages is. Oh, you can't even pick them up. Showed me. This bitch has been through some shit. I could never do this to myself. I don't care how desperate I was. I don't think I could ever do it. Oh. <coughs> Jesus Christ. I could never do this. If I was ever in a Saw movie, I'd be dead just off, off of principle. I could never do this to myself. Man. Like, I can feel it in my bones right now. This isn't even real. I can feel this happening. <laughs> I don't want to continue. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. Ouch. 
<laughs> now take a sip of your juice box. Oh wait, we don't have one. There it is! Uh, oh man, it gets stuck. Oh. oh, you see a little bit on the end there. I just did that to my arm. <clears throat> my throat is very dry. Let's, uh... <sighs> Take a sip of water. Oh, I gotta do the whole thing over? I guess I won't use the bricks this time. Oh, there's the hammer I should've grabbed. Oh! Get off of me! My child leg strength. Come on, baby, come on, baby. Grab it. I hate you! I hate you! I hate you! One more hate! Achievement unlocked! Hating zombies! Holy shit! What the? How the hell did he get in here? Little girl's tough as nails. Are you alright? The shed should have been safe. Girl's tougher than I thought. You patched yourself up? Where'd you get that stuff? Did she steal from your business. This doesn't change a thing. She hasn't done anything to us. Says the man not Left carrying no a choice, baby. Enough already. Guys, please. She must have stolen it. It didn't just magically appear. Unless she had some help. Bring her in, and I'll take a look at her arm. <sighs> Damn lurker sneaking around out here. We better get inside. You hungry? <laughs> yeah. Silence, motherfucker.
This might hurt a little. Ow. How she look? Her suturing skills need some work, but otherwise, I say she should be fine. So, it wasn't a lurker bite? If it was, the fever would have already set in, and her temperature would be through the roof. I wish you wouldn't have done what you did. Who do you think you are? You have nothing to say for yourself? We put well, I have you a lot in that to say, actually. out of concern for the safety of our loved ones. And then you escaped and persuaded my daughter to steal from us. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. But there are a few things you need to know about my daughter. Okay. She isn't like you. You may not get that initially. But once you're around her for a while, you'll understand. If she knew how bad the world is, what it's really like out there... She would cease to function. She's my little girl. She's all I have left. And I would ask that you stay away from her. Okay, absolutely. I don't like her anyway. Maybe you don't care, but it means a great <laughs> deal to me. Stay away from my daughter. Hey, uh, brought you some food if you're hungry. That's gonna leave one hell of a scar. Nothing. Yeah. You know, I get it. You're pissed that we locked you up. I'm sorry. Hey, look. I just want to say I'm sorry for well, for being a dick out there. I got kind of aggro, and that was definitely not cool. Nick's been known to go off every once in a while. Don't yeah. hold it against him. Yeah, I guess we all have our moments. I will. You definitely had one out there. Let it go. Put it all amongst yourselves. Whatever. <sighs> Look, he means well. He just loses it sometimes. I know it's no excuse, but Nick had a bad experience once with someone who got bit. And we all tried to control it, but they turned, and Nick lost his mom. He blames himself for it. Just so you know. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> so, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? To murder y'all. Let's see at your house. You know, what little kids do. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. Okay, let yourself heal up. Take some time to sort things out. Do you think everyone else will be okay with it? They'll just nope. have to deal with it. So, what happened to your parents? If you don't mind me asking. I mean, I assume what happened to them is what happened to just about everyone's parents. You're just so young. Didn't think you could have made it on your own for so long, but maybe you did. I did. Hey, I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't have asked. Done. Look, you don't have to say if you don't want. This man found me and took care of me. We met up with other survivors and we all tried to make it. But 
It didn't work. His name was yeah, Lee. That sucked. He taught me how to survive. He taught me how to shoot a gun. What uh, happened to him? I didn't kill him though, so that'd be wrong. You know what? It's okay. You don't have to talk about it if you don't want it. I hate to interrupt, but I'm out there standing watch and I can't help but notice this place is lit up like a goddamn beacon in the middle of the woods. Yeah, it's time to turn in anyways. Now get your winks while you can, because we're going fishing at first light. Couple fresh brookies for dinner? Wouldn't that be nice? Oh, you're still here. I wouldn't get comfortable if I were you. Oh, you bitch. Pretty sure Megan said, Nothing whose baby is it? <laughs> you got what you needed. She didn't like it. <laughs> you got what you came here for. Now go. Fuck you, bitch. I hope you die. Let's head on out. How you holding up? I heard you got an earful from Rebecca last night. Once she gets going, there's no bringing her back. Her bark's worse than her bite. Yeah. Probably. She's pregnant and all. She was in a mood last night, that's for sure. How far are these fish traps? It ain't much further. Anyone teach you how to shoot? By that I mean taught proper. Any idiot with a finger can shoot. How dare you, sir! It's okay if you can't. Maybe once things settle down, we'll get you a lesson or two. Nick was about your age, first time I took him hunting. Came across this beautiful 13-point buck just standing there on the ridge line. The boy takes the rifle, he lines up the shot just like I taught him, and then I hear him start whining. He turns to me and he says, I can't do it. I can't shoot it, Uncle Pete. Please don't make me shoot it. Hey! Why didn't you wait? You want us standing around while you piss on a tree? You know where the river is, boy. Anyway, true. so I grab the gun out of his hand before the big buck runs off, when bang, the gun fires. Boy nearly gut shot me, and of course the buck gets away. What are you going and telling her this shit for? Cause you almost blew her face off yesterday. Seems relevant. Motherfucker. Trying to let her know it's nothing personal with you. Why are you always giving me a hard time? Because you're always giving everyone else a hard time. I tried to apologize already. She ain't having it. Well, can you blame her? <laughs> no. You're always trying to embarrass me. You're doing a good enough job of that on your own. Leaving us again. I know where the fucking river is. So anyway, I found that buck later that season. Shot it right in the neck. Brought it up to my sister's figuring she'd want to freeze some of the meat. Nick didn't speak to me for weeks. Sometimes you gotta play a role. Even if it means people you love hate you for it. Yep. Uncle Pete! Nick! Nick! 
Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Well, the episode's almost over. And I'm going to choose the opposite of what I chose in my original playthrough. <sighs> Full of holes. Who do you think did this? And the opposite Not of what sure my yet, girlfriend chose. But it ain't your average <clears throat> Just to see what happens. Much I know. Think about it. Your carver, what do you do? Who's carver? He's some jerk we know. Check those guys there. Be careful. I'm knocking on my door. Some of them might still be moving. No, it's across the street. This one's shot too. Through the head? Yeah. Check the rest. And look for ammo. We're running low. Actually, let's talk to you first. Come on. What can I do? See if you can find anything else. Like what? Like what might tell us who did this. Okay. What do you got to say, boy? Get my saunter on over there. Can I help? I got it. <laughs> I got it. I'm just staring at this dead body. <laughs> there are more out there. This wasn't no rinky dink pissing match. What was it then? Fubar. Where are you going? We need to get the fuck out of here. Gotta check the rest. What? Why? Calm down and think about it, son. Calm down? We gotta get out of here now! Jesus Christ, get a hold of yourself! One of these folks might still be alive, and they might just be inclined to tell us who did this. We gotta do this now. Stay here. Keep searching these. This is a dumb idea. You know, Nick, I don't like this either. But sooner or later, you're gonna have to realize a simple truth. What, that you're an asshole? That nobody in this world is ever gonna give a goddamn whether you like something or not. You gotta grow up, son. Whatever. Come on, Clem. You wanna be useful? Keep a lookout on that tree line. I'll Whoever be useful, did this all right. might still be out there, waiting for another sucker to stumble across this mess. Just like technically, I would be more useful with a gun. Don't get jumpy on me now. Look, just keep your head on straight. Sir, who did this to you? Could you tell me, please? Shot to pieces. Hope this isn't anyone you know. No. Good. Damn it. More on that side. You check out these ones. See if there's anything on them that'll tell us who they were. Let's cut right to the chase. You, sir, look familiar. <gasps> what? Yo, that's my shit. <coughs> you motherfucker. <coughs> Do I know you? You were in the woods with Krista. The Where woman I was with. The fuck what happened to her? Is she? Please, tell me. Tell me. <coughs> Please. You, I, I better not give it to you. Although I did my original playthrough. Yeah, close that shit up. Just kick him in the face. Ah! All right, here's the choice we have. Pete, I'm fine. Who do we save? I'm fine. Nick or Pete? Just, just lost my footing. Damn it! 
God damn it. Lose your foot. Motherfucker was bit. Lurkers! I'm out of ammo! Come this way! Bitch! Damn it! You get your asses over here, both of I'll you! I'll cover you! We gotta get out of here! Get over here, God damn it! Can't you listen to me? What? Come on! Come on! Jesus! Leave him alone! Go, old man. Me and my girlfriend went to go help Nick. And if you don't help Pete, as we just saw me do, he just dies. That's interesting. I'm glad that I'm glad that there is a little change. What are you gonna do? Nice. I'm so glad I chose this. Someone's outside. Someone came here looking for you. A man. What? Oh, there's no Did he say what his name no was? Pete here. We know damn well who it was. So I guess we all know who what happens. He? One of the guys we were with before. What's he gonna do? I can't keep going. I figure we got about four. Five more days to reach those mountains. We ain't here to rob nobody. Just relax and put the gun down, man. I thought you were dead. Who the hell could that be? Okay. Episode 1, All That Remains of The Walking Dead Season 2 is now in the books. And here are the choices. I ran away and did not try to save Krista. 41.2% of us did. 47.5% uh, walked away from the dog and did not kill it. Mercy kill? Nope, did not do it. I'm shocked. I thought more people would have done that one. Or more people would have also helped Krista. 49.4% um, and I did not accept Nick's apology. Uh, that seems about right to me. 57% uh, of players refused to give him the water, the dying dude, the water, which I also did. That seems a little... seems a little low to me. Anyway. Um, and 60.6% say tried to save Pete. That seems high to me. But then again, this game came out uh, just under a month ago, so maybe just not enough people have played it. Either way, still seems, you know. Alright, so that was episode one. If you're watching on the stream, I appreciate it. If you're watching on YouTube, if episode two is up, go scope it out. If you're watching on the stream, subscribe to me. So you'll know when season two, episode two is up, and in the future, anything else I'm playing. So again, thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Check out the next episode when you can. Bye.